shot running game and the is that low and just a matter of time until we you know we got to land a shot you got to take the top off and uh, we're able to do that people have been waiting for a lot for Will Wright to make a play because mm-hmm. he's so physically so athletic yeah do you think maybe Minnesota got caught off guard there wondering who is this guy <laughs> I don't know about that um Sure. I mean, he, you know, he's a good route runner. I see it every day in practice, and it was great to see him get out there and finally, you know, make that play. And um, you know, hopefully, this is just uh, signs for things to come. You know, the one thing that does, you know, you look at the stat sheet, it doesn't show up as a catch regard. We also had the, you drew the two pass interference calls, which were huge plays. Yeah. I mean, is that one of the other things when you do throw the ball deep, you, you know, you, you have that advantage? They run the risk of that trying to defend it. Yeah, definitely. It's one on one, and the, the guy's got his back to the ball. It's hard for him to see it. So when I come back to make a play on the ball, he comes through me. It's going to be a penalty. Um, I would like to make that one because, you know. We had a nice catch, but um, yeah, those penalties are great to keep the chains moving and just keep rolling. Yeah. How did Joel throw the ball? <clears throat> Very well. I mean, <laughs> when Joel gets a rhythm, he's not many better than him. Well, he, and he bought some time. He moved around the pocket. Yeah. Things that people maybe assume he can't do. Yeah, he did a great job just taking what the defense has given him and just laying the ball out there and allowing us to make the play. Um, that's all you can do back there, and, it's, and then it's on us to come down with it. Alex, did you realize pretty early on you guys are going to have to make some plays in the passing game? And yeah, play? after those first few drives, we knew, you know, obviously they're a good team. The record shows it, and the team, you know, we've seen on film. <clears throat> the safety was very low, as we expected, maybe a little lower than we expected, but um, we were able to, you know, land some shots, which helps us in offense and helps us as a team. Alex, tell, take us through the 70-yarder. What, what uh, You had to make the catch and the run. Uh, how did that all unfold in your eyes? Yeah, we needed to play. Um, we were not rolling very good on offense and um, play that we've had in for a few weeks now. I haven't got it called. I was able to work him at the line, get on top of him, and then stick him at the top. And Joel, like I said, put it right where it needed to be, and I was able to uh, come down with it and run after the catch. Did you think you had the end zone, or did you feel that guy closing fast? I saw him, I saw him right when I caught it. I saw him going at an angle, so I figured he'd probably get me down uh, near the 10, try to cut back on him, and the other guy pursued on me. You got 160 yards on a game that clinches a trip to the Big Ten Championship. Mm-hmm. Did you ever expect that to happen as a walk on from Darlington? Yeah, I mean, like I was saying earlier, I mean, that's what we, as a competitor, that's what you want to do. You want to play your best in the, the biggest games. Big time players make big time plays. Coach says it all the time, and uh, to be able to help my team, help these seniors, and um, it was it was huge. Do you think you and uh, Aberdeers have shown a lot of kids in Wisconsin what can be done if you work hard? Yeah, I think you work hard and you're given an opportunity, anything can happen. You know, that's. As a competitor, as you know, an athlete, it's all you can ask for is an opportunity, and I'm very grateful for that. When did you hurt the shoulder? I hurt it last week against Iowa. Um, just banged up a little bit, but just it's, it's it'll be fine. Just a little banged up, which we could go. Because Wheelwright said that you, you, when you hurt it again today, then that's what put him on the field. Yeah, I, um, actually, I when I I got tackled there, that last screen um, that we got, that got us down there. Got just twisted a little bit in a pile, so then I just came out for a few plays to <clears throat> get you know get right, and you know he came in there, stepped in, and that's that's what you got to do. You got to be ready to play whenever your number's called, and coach stresses all the time, and uh, Rob came in, and that's what he did. 